In case your pump is turning, but no water is coming out, you want to check if you primed the pump. If it still isn't pumping, start excluding any leakages on the suction side. First, check the suction hose by filling it with water and lifting it up from both sides. In case of a leakage, water will drip or spray out. If the suction hose is not the issue, continue to check the connector and connection into the air vessel. Fill the suction hose pipe. Place the suction hose like you would onto the air vessel that has been removed from the pump. Block the air vessel and lift up the hose pipe. You should feel water pressing against your hand blocking the air vessel. Check for any leakages around the hose pipe to the connector and the connector into the air vessel. If this is fine, check the air vessel by swapping the air vessels. If there was a leakage at the suction air vessel, it will now start pumping and show on the discharge side as water will be leaking out. Simply tighten the air vessel top or replace the o-ring if necessary. If this is not an issue, it is time to open up the pump. Check in the pump cylinder if the suction valve has gotten damaged. If it has been, you will have to replace it. If the suction or discharge valve has gotten saucer shaped, lifting up, here you can see a little bit of saucer shaping. You can pull it off and simply turn it around and place it back. Then check on the piston seal. Is it pinched inside its slot somewhere? Or can you see wear marks? Is it as flat as the piston itself? Then it's time to replace it. You can also place it into the cylinder and feel if there is some friction when you're pushing it up and down. There should only be a little bit of friction. You can also check if you can see any obvious big gaps between the piston and the cylinder itself. Then check on the step rings. Maybe it has gotten cut or simply moved out of its slot. By now you should have found the issue somewhere. If you didn't, please create a support case via www.support.futurepump.com and we will help to repair your pump.